doing this at all. This evening, I'm going to do a video of Jack and the Box Gully in St. Thomas. And I'm at Prout Village at the moment. Prout St. Thomas. Now heading towards Jack in the Box Gully. So this is Prout Village. And above me will be the Stronghold Plantation. Straight ahead will be strong hope that will lead back to Mount Water Spring and Mount Wilton and back to St. Joseph. So this is so this is Prout and St. Thomas. Looking back through the Prout village. So this is the road of the Sugar Hill and Chalk. You bus to pass. On the way to St. Joseph. Gully here, Jack in the Box Gully here, which is known as the Granddaddy of Gullies. Forgot to mention that. So I'm in the parish of St. Thomas. Looking back at Jack in the Box, the road, Pro Mayor Road, and Jack in the Box Gully all here. So Jack in the Box Gully is known to be a dangerous place. It was for years. It was a it was a dumping ground. This is not the part, this is not the whole gully. The, the gully is further up, but I will not go all the way up there today. As I just said before, it is known as the granddaddy of gullies. And one thing about the parish of St. Thomas here in Barbados, it is where you'll find most of the gullies. You, if you come to this park, come into this parish of St. Thomas, this is where you will meet all the gullies. They have Jack in the Box Gully where I am now, and that Snow Hall Gully, which is also in St. Thomas, Stony Gully, Russia Gully, which is another dangerous place. People used to dump you and kill you out here and throw you in the gully. There where your family can't find you. And they search Jack in the Box Gully. Then they will find you through there. So this is the road. This is, all, this is also a back road. It is off the beaten track. It is off the main road. And this is a back road. For motorists wishing to get away from the busy traffic on the highway, especially those persons that are heading towards the north or west of the islands, and they're coming from the south or the east, or use this road, or people that want to get into St. Thomas, that don't want to travel the Warrens area, which is the main route into St. Thomas or to the north or west of the island would use this road yeah, this road will put them there faster once upon a time this road was very narrow two cars could not fit through at one time but when they paved the road and widened it between 2012 and 2013 between 2011, 2012 and 2013 when they widened the road and paved it then it became accessible to vehicles as well
So the gully will be further up here. The once upon a time they used to dump all beds, all fridges, all cars, all stuff in the gully. Yes, in 2019, which was three years ago, they did massive cleaning down in the gully and take, taking all the stuff out of the gully. Looking about a Prout village in St. Thomas. You can see the chimney for the farmer operates plantation. This is just across from from Prout Village where it started from. Operates is just across over from the over the, over the other side from Prout. Where operates plantation used to be. Then it later became the West Indies Records Limited. It was operates sugar factory and plantation. Operates border St. Thomas and St. George. The part where the factory was was is, is St. George, is St. Thomas. And it later became West Indies Records Limited. We used to produce records for reggae music, ska music, calypso music, spooky music, Caribbean ballads, and other forms of Caribbean West Indian music. They used to produce records for um, Wendy Allen, Karen Leacock, my father who is Satchmore, and also. Um, And also um, Richard Stout and those people and Jackie Opel. And then now it, it, it's the Barbados packaging industry. So Jack in the Box Gully is a shortcut for many people trying to get away from the traffic. And this is the beautiful countryside in the center of Barbados. St. Thomas and St. George are the two central parishes here on the island, best referred to as the heart of Barbados or the central uplands of Barbados. Many people use this road to pick it. This can also be an access route, an easy access route from St. Thomas to St. George. To make that St. Thomas. Yeah, yeah, St. George connection. People can use this road to get there faster as well. Come through Jack in the Box Gully and then come through Pro and then come through Operates and then you are into St. George. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, thank you guys for watching now. And over here, you can see the trees, the tall trees are over to the other end over here for Stronghold Plantation. Stronghold is in St. Thomas further up from Prout Village, instead of going to Jack in the Box, keep straight up and then make the next left turn, then you will come across Strong Hope. And these tall trees are on that outside of that plantation. Come back to watch Prout Village. So as I said before, we are in close proximity to Harrison's Cave. And we're at Smohaw Gully, Harrison's Cave is just when you go keep along this road and keep straight up, you will come up to Harrison's Cave. Which is in St. Thomas. Thank you guys for watching now. And have a blessed evening. Stay tuned for the other ones.